The main focus of Orca Lab is to follow the lives of the orcas in the northern resident community. That's our main focus. There are other things. We are, of course, interested in, in big orcas. Uh, we're interested in humpback whales. We are land-based, so we have pulled away from the water in a sense that we try to sit in one place and have the scene come to us. So anything that moves, lives and breathes, we're trying to watch, but we're doing it from shore. We started with a remote hydrophone network in the early 1980s. And because the northern resident orcas are vocal, it means that we're able to follow them acoustically through their day and through the different spaces that they occupy. I really like the sound because that's where we started and where we started to learn about these different families. Um, the cameras are interesting and they're a good vehicle for showing people whales in their own habitat. You know, people are fascinated by whales. People, you know, see this almost perfect form of existence. Orcas, particularly, live in these very wonderful close family groups that stay together for life. They don't fight each other. People see that and say, that is a living, breathing, thinking being. And I can imagine its life. In some small way, we demonstrate that it's possible to learn about the whales without interfering with their lives. I think that's useful. Just to stand back and see that the whales continue, I think, is, a, is, is for me quite profound. But really the biggest value of what we have is just the ability to follow the lives of the whales over you know, at least three generations or four generations now. You know? I, I think it's certainly interesting, maybe important. Mm -hmm.